from Hawaii to, uh, was it, um, Virgin Islands? Yeah, St. Croix. So there's antennas, it's called a synthetic aperture. By, by spreading them across this, this side of the planet like that, they, they can basically pretend like the radar dish is as big a diameter as the length between those two, oh, awesome. which is almost the, the diameter of the Earth, or the, yeah, diameter of the Earth. So what do they do with it? So you rent time on this thing, research <laughs> agencies, universities, physicists, astronomers, they rent time on this to watch celestial observations in, in whatever wavelengths this thing picks up, and all, all, what is it, 14 of these, or 10? All 10 of these antennas? Like, when you see this one move, the other ones in like St. Croix and Hawaii are also moving, pointing at the same thing in the sky. That's how, that, that's how it's a synthetic, not necessarily aperture, but. That's awesome. The Very Long Baseline Array. Interesting name for it. And how many people just drive by here and never know? Right. Look at those two little wind speed things on each side. Mm -hmm. Anemometers. Yeah. Oh yeah, I can see the little tiny anemometer. And there's a thing that, when I was younger, I used to think it was a simple little toy. It still looks like it's something that's like calibrated on like the orbital laser. Yeah, could be. Yeah. Orbital command has spoken. So normally if it's not COVID and you come out here during the week, they've got the gate open. You can walk up and they'll like give you a tour. Wait, oh, really? Yep. So you can get a tour usually if you come out. Depends what they're doing. When it's not COVID and I mean, they won't let you sometimes. have a moving platform or anything, but right. they'll walk you around and show you things. Apparently these, and I've, we've never got the tour, but apparently these guys get like extremely bored. Uh. Oh, so there's somebody out here all the time? Well, yeah, and it's not doing research. All they're here for is maintenance. They just repair this thing. It's moving equipment. It's all moving parts. They wear uh -huh. So these guys here are, are just really high-end engineers. They go out and keep this thing running and moving and make sure things work so that when the next call up to point such and such location comes up, it's functional, it can work. All the all the actual programming and all that I think is in New Mexico. It says it on here. Yeah, it's operation centers in Socorro, New Mexico. <laughs> and these guys out here are the site technicians and they just keep things working. Wow. Another yeah, thing that makes it so terrifying is this is your rest. It looks like something you've seen like fallout or like that. Yep. Like fallout or something. Yeah, and like there's the entrance. It's just like. Yeah, it doesn't even look like a private driveway. But leave it to you to have found it here. So all other all the other the other nine satellites are all moving the same. They're all pointing at the same thing. Yep. Yeah, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. 
Now they might be pointing like a half a degree or a degree off, but they may be pointing at something like one of Jupiter's moons, which is also the point, or they may be pointing at the center of some galaxy. 30, 30, light years away. And that, that really big part on the little, on the thing is probably a wave. Wow! At the bottom of that circle. Oh! Yeah. It's just like spinning a, spinning a heavy wave is easier than lifting half that much weight. Yeah, like. Oh wow, that much bigger. Where was that one at? That's the one in Korea. Hmm. So we'll have to add these to our list of things to see when we go places. And then maybe we can actually be there sometime when we can see, get a tour. Do you see the wheels down at the bottom, guys? Yeah. Railroad. Oh, there's a railroad Not around. Railroad right? <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. Stand it up so we can see it better. And that three of those mechanical parts are damaged, it would be almost non right? Yeah, I don't know. That's redundant too. Yeah, maybe we have some extra space, but that would be oh, yeah. on the map. Yeah. And that would mean the other satellites are looking directly at us. It's like they're looking at something, things that are very far apart. Yeah, we cleaned it off so we can see it a little bit more.